How do you take a bad website and turn it into something beautiful like this in just five minutes? I designed this website from looking like this using a simple method that blew up my agency because it's 10x faster. So to start, let me show you step by step how I fixed this website in minutes and how that small shift helped me finally grow my web agency. Okay, so here we are inside the editor of the old website. And the first thing I'll do is just create a big white gap here between the old design and the new design. Now it's just a blank canvas, but designing from scratch is almost impossible. I need something to build on, something to react to. So I go inside my elements of templates here and find something with a clean and professional look. And you can also access all these templates in the link below if you also want to 10x your web design process. And don't worry, using a template is not the trick that's coming up. So I think I will choose this one. Let's have a look at the live demo. That's really cool, right? And you can maybe see that it looks a bit like the final result. Let's scroll down and have a look at it. Yeah, that's. I love this template. This is probably one of my favorite templates. So what's also really cool is that this is actually also fully responsive. So let's go ahead and import it. I'll just click download here and just download the home page design like this. Then we'll go back and import the template. Really easy, done. So now that's imported and we still have the old design here at the bottom. So what I'll do is start editing the layout. I'll go ahead and copy the old menu design here and go back up to the new design and insert the menu here. Then I find the navigator here. So you can see now we have a clear overview of each section because this is a template. So I'll go ahead and move the old header down in the new design here and then just start copying everything from the other header. So for example here, I'll just copy the section and pass in the style. And the same for the menu and over here. Done. And then I can delete the template menu up here. So I'm using everything from the template, but I'm combining it with elements from the original design. Next up is the hero section. The old site had a very small hero section, so I want to upgrade that by using the full width hero section from this template. So I try inserting the old video here, but honestly, this does not look that good. So I actually searched online and found this video. So I just downloaded this and inserted it here. So I'm combining the template with elements from the original site to create something new. For example, the background overlay here, that's probably not something I would have thought of if I hadn't used a template. All right, so the design already looks 10x better, but here's where most designers go wrong, because they start applying the entire template to every other section. What I would like to do instead is go one step further. I want something completely different here that this template does not have. So I jump back into my templates here and find a template I want to use for this section only. On this live demo, I want this section here. So only this section. So I'll just go back to the template and download the service page like this. And then I import it like I just did before. Done. And now we just need to customize this. So what's the trick? It's not just that I used a template. It's how I used it. When you start with the right template, you skip 80% of the hard work. That's the part most designers miss. And that's why every project ends up stealing hours that they don't have. And that's also why this only took me five minutes to redesign. But how do you do this for yourself? Well, there are a lot of template services out there, but I personally struggled to find ones with that next level clean touch. So I started creating my own and now you can use them too if you want to save time. I'll leave a link in the description below. So now you have seen how easy it is to 10x your web design workflow using the right method. But what if you want to build something for free? In the next video, I'll show you exactly how I created one of my most advanced designs step by step. You learn how to build the full project completely free and, and I'll even include all the materials.